Solid. All right, cool. It's bootlegcat.com. Chilling right now with my dude, man. Live on the bus. He about to go on stage and kill shit. YG. What up? What up, man? Hey, shit. Thank you for making uh, my ninja a song that is uh, white people friendly now oh, yeah, with the yeah, my yeah. hitter. You know I have to clean it up. You <laughs> me? Yo, you was telling me how, how long did it take you to come up with the replacement for the N-word? It took like two weeks. We were in the studio. We were stuck. You feel me? Like, and it was two weeks past we got it, it just came. You feel me? That's how you gotta do it sometimes. You gotta let it go and let it come back. You and I always talk, man. I always feel like Def Jam just uh, habitually mishandles YG. I feel like you should already been had an album out. You've been had radio singles for days. Yeah. Um, what what is different now? What do you think is different about this song? Because I know you broke to me should have been been gone. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But what's different about this record? Um, I feel like this record is more like is you feel me? It's hitting people like a lot way more people feeling this than you broke. Cause probably the you broke is like I'm downgrading women, females, and shit. This record, I'm like, I'm uplifting homies. I'm talking right. about, you feel me, like my homies and shit. So, everybody around the world got homies. You black, white, man, it don't matter, you feel me. And everybody say the word, you feel me. They say, my nigga, even though, you feel me, the history on it is what it is. I don't say it, though. But it's people that, you feel me, yeah, it's people you. that say it. You feel yeah, me, like, it's a lot of people that say that. You feel me? They probably don't say it in front of certain people. But of course not. You feel me? They say it though. So, but like the song, you now I came with the song is just like, oh shit! Like I don't know. I feel like it was something that uh, needed to happen. The last time uh, I interviewed you, you, you made the, the CTE announcement. Yeah. You aligned yourself with Jeezy. Yeah, I did. Kind of shook too, the, bro. We shook the internet up a little yeah. bit with that one. Hell yeah. Um, what? The difference now that you were rolling with Jeezy, what what is the the benefit of having Jeezy, you know, rolling with you, executive producing the album, and uh, having that 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 guy in your corner, like, you know, what's the difference between before and now? Hey, young, for me, he did so play his record and went platinum every time he dropped one. Yep. I think you feel me? So it's like that's a plus. And he like he always gives advice off off the top. Then it's like the situation with the label. Like he got juice at the label. Of course he so it's like me having my record, the record I got right now, him saying, press the button on that, you feel me that from that help. So it's all that like it's, it probably seem and look like it's small shit, but that's the shit that matter right there. Did he help you and uh Rich Homie Quan hook up? Was that like something that he yeah, had his hand in? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They did that. Him and Ant uh, called Carver's when we went to the studio. This before some type of way record blew up. And shit, then we got in and I had the idea of the hook and shit. I told him the idea, then he took it and added on. We did it just like that. That's what's up, man. So, um, look, if you come back in six months and there's still not a YG album, I say you ask Def Jam to let you out your deal. You sling your album for a hundred dollars like what like, Nipsey like just did. Nip, <laughs> my nigga came up. Hey yo, what do you like? You know, I know you and Nipsey man are, are super tight, man. You guys do so much music together. It's supposed to be a big thing coming out. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm but what, what's up? Shit. What's up with with, with this being slang is out for hundred dollars? I was out there in LA. I went out there for it, man. It was incredible. It was special to see. Like, uh, how do you feel about that? Is it motivation? Is it kind of like to that's me? It kind of is. It's some new rule shit. Like, that's some new Shit, motivation, he changed the game, he made a statement, but... Hundred racks, like Hundred racks, easy, and it was, like, it be a lot of people down talking to Nick, like, saying a whole bunch of shit, where it's just be like, I'll be like, yeah, like, the homie fucked up, like, right? the homie know what he's doing, you feel me? Like, sure do. He's smart than a motherfucker, you feel me? So, yeah, he just shout for that, changed the game, made a statement, made history that night, you feel me? Yeah, that's what it is. He's gonna make niggas start saying they doing the same shit he did. Can you see yourself, like I said, like, you know, you and Def Jam been rolling with Douglas since Tudor and Booty. Can you see yourself getting to a point? Because I feel like there's very few artists that have been, you're putting out so much free material for your fans, you've built up that fan base that very few people have. And you're in a position where I feel like if you said, yo, I'm dropping the tape in two weeks, it's gonna be free, but all my real fans, Show up to Fairfax with a hundred dollars, you go get a one a thousand. I feel like you can sell that bitch out the same way this did. Oh, yeah. That type of shit go through your mind, like you know, like. Nah, I'm not gonna go do a broke thing. 
I feel like a lot of people are though. And no, it, it's a lot of motherfuckers. You feel me? And, and it wouldn't be wrong if they did, as long as they deserve uh, to do something like trend, that. He tripped. He started work. a trend. Yeah. You feel me? We trend, so that's what we do. You feel me? Niggas take the sound all day. I'm not finna go take another nigga sound though. Right. Nipsey just did. He did. Set a new trend. Um, I'm not finna go follow the homie. Like he did what he did was a move, but that was a play. But. I'm not finna go copy right. off. I'm gonna come with something else. That's what's up, man. Uh, you guys are supposed to drop a mixtape together. I was talking to Nipsey in LA, and he had alluded to the fact that it might not be just two of y'all on the tape together. Y'all might be bringing in someone else. Oh, yeah. Nah, we doing it. It's not gonna be a tape. I heard. I heard. I, but we ain't finna he wouldn't get into tell me. He we wouldn't finna, tell me. Well, listen. We he wouldn't tell me who. He I'm wouldn't tell even, me I'm who. I'm not telling nothing. But I'm gonna just throw it out. My prediction is YG. Nipsey Hustle, Dom Kenny. Hell no, you wait. I'm off? Yeah, you off. I think, he, I think he's full of shit right now. Nah, you off. I'm I off? I'm off? Okay. You off. Okay, okay. Well, that's just my prediction, man. Is, there, is it possible for you and, and Mustard to, like, y'all gotta, like, start getting royalties off of some of these cats, man? I know these niggas taking up the all the shit from the man's shit. Man. Is it hard, like, because you, I know you run into a lot of artists. Whether it be award shows in LA or whatever, whatever, a lot of like, like real talk, like a lot of people are, are doing the sound that you and Mustard are kind of trademarks. And, you know, is it hard not to say something to a motherfucker when you see it? Yeah, for me? Yeah. Very hard. Because I'm one of the type of things. I mean, it's hip hop, you know what I'm saying? So. Fuck the fuck, fuck the hip hop, nigga. Like, you feel me? Nigga, this life, nigga. You feel me? It's, I don't know. Like, fuck that hip hop shit. It's life, like. I don't know just how I get down. Like, I'm the type of nigga, if I see somebody we got an issue, I'm gonna say something. You right. Know? Yeah. Fuck all that other shit. I see you got the 2K14 over there on top of the Xbox. Oh, yeah, I got what, the 2K14. What team you running with on that thing? I got the Madden. I don't fuck with this 2K14 like that. But if you got some money, you put up for Madden. You do you like that on Madden? What? You serious on the Madden? Shit. Have you played a game on Madden yet? Nah, but he don't want my favorite. I heard, I heard the game is, is pretty serious with, with the video games. I mean, shit, I just got the phone with, bro. We can, uh, you feel me? We can line up a little game, you sound. You feel me? Game, when you see this, nigga. Special challenge. Be on Madden, nigga. I'll be on the Madden, nigga. Run that, nigga. What's, 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 what's your squad on Madden? I'm a Niners, you feel me? Ah, oh, damn. Niners. Kaepernick, yeah. yeah. Kaepernick, the whole woo -wop. You got a, you got a uh, online tag? You play online? Nah, I don't play online. You feel me? I ain't did that shit. See, listen. YG don't realize that he ain't, he ain't about that life till he starts playing online. And you mm. get fucked up by a nine-year-old kid. Oh, man. I, with I, no I, life. I, you know who hopped on the bus who? and beat me, though? The nigga James Harden. Oh, really? God. He up in Houston. Killed it? Damn. Oh, God. That's what's up, man. Nigga. So, top yeah. of the year, um, the album, My Crazy Life. Uh, hopefully, a super album with you, Nipsey, and someone who I got wrong, apparently. I mean, we not even doing none of that. We got, we working on, like... How many records you and Nipsey got? Right now, yeah, like how many? We ain't got nothing right now. That's what I'm telling nothing. you. He doing his shit right now. I, I know you doing your shit, shit right now. So, like, we gonna do like, cause we already told people we gonna do a mixtape or something. So we gonna come with some shit, like, you feel me? Can but, you see yourself putting out a, another tape before the album? Or is that? I think it kind of already be on it. Like at this point, it's album time, right? It's album time. I'm making money. It's album time. And they can support the single on iTunes right now. Yeah, my hit on iTunes right now. What's Go like, do it. It's you like downloaded all this free music. I always tell people, man, the very least they can go buy the fucking single off. Yeah, the single like a dollar and thirty nine cent. It's like top uh, five on the top ten rap hip hop songs on iTunes, and it's like you feel me? It's chart on Billboard and all that already. So go support. Shout out to Monster Two, sick under the yeah. blanket, man. Yeah, the homie right here. Shit, <laughs> you already know, shit. man. It's going down. YG, appreciate you, brother. Yeah, you already know. It's all right.